Did you know that getting a shiny flamingo, the new Paldean flamingo, is easier to get than ever? That's right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can force spawn your shiny flamingo, the little bit off peak flamingo, in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. What's going on, guys? I'm Dom from the Game Leaders, and I'm here to help your shiny hunting out by showing you specific spots that you might not have known where Pokemon are spawning in in specific sequences but only for specific types it's actually really super cool all right let me not dawdle out any longer let's head into paldea all right my friends step number one the first thing we're going to do is i need you to head to the glacido gym once you're here we're going to take a little bit of a hike up the mountain we're going to head to the highest peak in paldea you'll know you are here not only by this mark right here on the map but you're going to notice by when you actually get there, you're going to see this lovely sign. The sign literally says that this is the highest peak in Paldea. If you're here, you're good to go. Step number two. Once we are here, we're going to go ahead and throw down a save. We're going to be end up making a shiny sandwich. And we don't want to waste any ingredients. And we want to make sure that if we have any Herba Mystica and we need to redo a sandwich, that we can get it back. All right, now that you've thrown down a save, we're on to step number three. Step number three, it's time to go ahead and throw down a picnic. So find a good spot right here on the peak to actually allow you to throw down a picnic. I myself am about right here. Go ahead and throw it down. Now we're going to make a sandwich. For this shiny sandwich, we're going to need encounter power. It's a requirement. For a flamigo, we need one part cucumber. And yes, be ready for this. We're going to need four parts pickle. That's right, four parts pickle. We're going to need one part cucumber, four parts pickle, and then we're going to need two sour herba mystica. Now, of course, as always, this is just a FYI. Different combinations of this sandwich totally work, but you have to have encounter power. No encounter power, no worky. That's the rule here. Encounter power and sparkling power are the two things that you have to have for this method to work. All right. Now that we've made our sandwich and we have sparkling power and encounter power, it's time to go do some work. Step number four, go ahead and follow my path right here. We're going to be flying down the mountain to this very specific spot right next to the waterfall. I need you to, once we arrive here, to kind of set up at the edge or the lip of the waterfall here. And we're going to be looking over to our right side. As you see here, we have some flamigo that are starting to spawn in. We are all set up. At this point, get out your camera or get out your in-game zoom via the Nintendo Switch function and just begin looking for your flamigo. You're going to notice it by it being a off pink color versus the very dark pink color that Flamingo usually is. As you're kind of looking over them, go ahead and once you feel like they're not spawning anymore, go ahead and head back to the edge of the lip of where you're currently standing. And when you head there, you can look back at the Flamingos and you'll notice that they are going to despawn. Essentially, what we need to do is run back and forth as they finish spawning to go and despawn them and then respawn them again. And since there's no picnic method here, we're just kind of have to keep running back and forth as they kind of finish off spawning. And if you do this, you know, kind of back and forth method enough, eventually you will get your shiny flamingo. It's actually pretty easy to get, just like this one right here. That's right. This one kind of gave me a hard time to actually catch it, but it did spawn fairly quickly in my sandwich, and I was very excited about it. All right, my friends, this is how you get a shiny flamingo in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet very easily by force spawning it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, throw us a like and subscribe for more content like this before you leave. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.